Hello, I'm the Bowmeister, and welcome back to the Pokemon Silver Nuzlocke. Last time, well, we got our Pokemon. We got ourselves a Cyndaquil. Today, now that we got the Pokeballs, and go through our Pokemon tutorial, he's gonna show us how to catch a Pokemon. <coughs> We're actually gonna start adding members to our team here. So he's gonna get a wild. He's gonna catch Rattata. Which means I should get ready here, because I don't know what I'm gonna have yet. Will it be a Pidgey? Will it be a Sentret? My goal is Sentret. Honestly. We'll see, though. That's how you do it. If you weaken them first, Pokemon are easier to catch. Alright. So our encounter for Route 29 is a Sentry. Okay, we'll take it. Schmeck. Another tackle. And let's, let's try to go in and throw a po Pokeball at it. It's not in the red. But we'll try it nevertheless. Got it! So we got ourselves a Sentry. Cool. Sentry. It stands on its tail so it can see a long way. If it spots an enemy, it cries loudly to warn its kind. And we're gonna give a na nickname to Sentry. That's a male. Um, let's see. Just because I'm feeling goofy. Say hello to Ralph the Centric. Give me a second here to get scrolled down so I can add Ralph. Uh, give me a second. That. I guess. There we go. Alright. So now we got ourselves Ralph the Sentry. Oop. Cool. Now let's go heal up. I'm gonna try to make it to Violet City before it gets dark. I set it for 4.30. There's a specific reason why I made it dark, or why I made it this time. Because there's a Pokemon I want. <laughs> and I'm gonna get it. And I think it will be a very valuable addition to the team once I get it trained up. Of course, we gotta get to the point first, so let's go. And now I think I'll go ahead and work on... I could've had a Pidgey. But I didn't. I didn't get one. Oh well. There's still technically, a, I think, a couple more chances to get a Pidgey if I really want one. Tackle. Ooh, critical hit. If you see the Pokeball in the corner, it means we've caught it! But since we're not going for a type's catching run yet, ow! You know, 
we're fine. Please don't hit that hard. Thank you. Thank you, Blaze! Finally, level six! And learn smokescreen! Okay, we'll take that. Having the accuracy drop, dropping maneuver will actually help. We'll go and burn through the one potion on planes. Just because I'm gonna want him for the next route. But I'll switch Ralph in. We'll get hopefully get Ralph some experience early on here. I can't remember if there's a Pokeball over there or not. I may have to switch over to Ralph here in a minute anyway. Or right, switch over back to place in a second, because on this encounter, it's what I do want, especially for early on, if I can get to it. If it gives me the encounter. Which, by the way, it's Route 46. We're at the bottom of the mountain road. Our encounter on Route 46 is exactly what I wanted. It's a Geodude, level two. So it shouldn't be too terribly bulky. All right, come on out, Blaze. We're gonna go ahead. We're gonna hit it with a smoke screen, actually. And we'll sit here and we'll just, we'll tackle it for a minute. There we go. That'll help me a little bit, so we can get this take down this Geo dude. Hopefully. Gonna take him down ourselves. Do I need to hit it with another smoke screen? I might have to. I missed. How did I miss? It's not supposed to happen. Another smoke screen that puts you down too. There. Seriously? All right, I'm gonna try a Pokeball. Let the tackling continue! There we go. Ooh, a critical hit! You're not supposed to get me one of those yourself! Now, I should have addressed something earlier that I didn't address starting out. I fa I lost to so I lost to uh to Stan. Cuz I didn't cuz I don't officially count the Nuzlocke started until after I get my first Pokéball until after I get my Pokéballs. It didn't matter if I lost what or lost. At least that's how I'm going with it. Uh, Geodude, it uses its arms to steadily climb steep mountain paths. It swings its fists around, if angered. Oh, nope. So. Uh, you know what, let's, yeah, let's. I'm trying to think of a good name for... Because I 
don't actually know. Hang on a second here. Gonna do a quick research. I wanted to do this. do okay, if I can spell it right which I was Maya Via now you're like why Maya Via well if it was a boy, I was gonna name it The Rock. Because originality is a thing, but no. Uh, yeah, I was originally gonna name it The Rock, but because it was actually a female Geodude, I decided to just go with the family name Maya Via. Which is what actually, uh, which is what The Rock originally went out under, actually. He was originally Rocky Maya Via when he first debuted in World Wrestling Entertainment back in 1996. I think it's one of his first matches was at Summer or Survivor Series for WWE. Because he had that god awful, ugly streamer top. Alright, so right now we are gonna go ahead and put Maya Via in front. Again, try to get some try to get some levels on him. If we can. Hopefully we don't have too many encounters getting to Violet City. Hopefully. He says, as he encounters a Pidgey. Again, if I can just make it to 31. Before it gets dark. So I don't take it. Sweet, gotta miss. Bump. Now I just gotta remember. I do remember. Gotta, I have to be extra super careful when it comes to uh, Falconer, because his pigeon does know mud slap and mud slap. Rex. Currently, two thirds of my team here. So I just gotta remember to be careful. Yeah, no, we're gonna try and make it to the to Cherry Grove. Try is the key phrase here. I need a, if I need to drop uh, or drop out uh, my idea here. Maybe we'll see, we'll see how much damage my idea does here. A speed tie. That's decent. Since a critical hit here might do two to my idea, I should be. Switch to Blaze for now. Tackle. Okay. 
There we go. That's better. Yeah, there might be a bit of grinding going on here later. <laughs> Because need to do need to grind. Uh, I'll switch out Ralph for Maya for now. For now. I mean, hopefully I can find Kakunas. That would help. That would help, honestly. Oh, I forgot to put Maya on. <laughs> so. that as I get set here. Set. Come on, Ralph. Big it's gonna get, so there we go. That is actually a very impressive amount of experience. To get it, if I can hit Violet City at least, it can get ready. Alright, let's go. Thank you, thank you for waiting. All right, let's switch back to Maya Via, just because again I want her to want her to get some experience, and we're going back to the Pokemon. All right, we need to go to the Pokemon. Of course, we didn't get a whole lot of cash. A whole lot of cash. We didn't get any cash, but five Pokeballs should be enough. Potions. We'll load up on potions and grab an ink too. There we go. Save, save at least a little though as we move along into the next area. All right, so we're back on Route 30, our encounter. This time is a Pidgey. Okay, cool. I'll take it. I'll gladly take a Pidgey. Of course, can't. Not gonna count. Not gonna count my chickens before they hatch. Before they hatch. Uh, there we go. Oh, did I not? Okay, did. Again. Okay. Again, because critical hits can happen, and I don't want to lose this thing. There we go. Just like that! That could have been bad, but it is a critical hit in my favor. So we're going to do that, and meanwhile... Got ourselves a Pidgey. Pidgey, commonly found in grassy areas and forests, it is very docile and will chase off enemies by flapping up sand. Yes, we're gonna go ahead and give a nickname to Pidgey. That is going to be. We're gonna be called. We're gonna call you Pete. Pete the Pidgey. Alright, so there we go. We got our we've got four so far. We got one more we need to get, which is at Violet Sit, which will be Actually we have two more we can get. 
because we have 31 and we have Dark Cave. And I may say Dark Cave for just a minute. Because I do want to add in, uh... What's its face? Uh, the Pokemon I want to catch. Like, there's one specific Pokemon that only comes out at night. That I want to catch. And no, it's not Spinarak. Spinarak comes out at night in gold. Alright, so that's my idea. Hi. Hi, darling. Yes, I know what you want, kitty. And as soon as I get... A chance. I'm actually gonna go ahead and do something real quick. I'm gonna look at something. Where's something I haven't looked at at night? Oh, I need to make sure I have the right anchor. That's a good that's a good grouping of Pokemon. Try to get my Avia to level up here so we can get her. Make her a good part of the party. Right? Right. I'm also looking at. Gonna look at Cyndaquil here to see just what level Cyndaquil levels are. What, what level Cyndaquil is. Cyndaquil lives at member at 12 ish. How about. Pidgey. Did you learn anything useful? Gust at nine. Ish. That's okay, at least. At the very least, I have a few Pokemon that can actually live a Vine Whip. Three to be specific, so if I just try and get them trained up a little bit, it'd be great. So poor Myvia is gonna have to be stuck doing like switch training. Ooh, that's a good start. That's actually a really good start getting up to 10. Kakuna, give me a Kakuna. Another Pidgey. Level four this time. We'll see just hard he hit this time. One, okay. How hard do we hit on a Pokemon that is one level higher than us? Fair. Fair amount, actually. Scratch your face. Miss. Tackle. There we go. Almost! Almost! There we go. Oh, almost get another level all by itself! Nice! We're actually we're gonna take a take a quick peek here. We're gonna go to Mr. Pokemon. Please let this actually be a that's a wheel. We'll let Maya be in for a for a second here. St string shot's not gonna do any good against Pokemon that is slower than you! Oh. There we go. Maybe, just maybe, we can get it to, uh... Poison Sting. Chubby. Oh boy, poison! Please kill it! Thank you! Might be a level 4! Almost level 5! Sweet. Uh, first things first, I'm kinda glad I got that antidote. I'll go ahead and use that. And for the moment, anyway, we'll go ahead and switch out. Let's touch up for Pete. If all spells, we'll just switch train for a little bit. Or find a Kakuna. If we find a Kakuna, that'd be even better. Nope, it's Pidgey. We'll switch up. 
Yep, so we'll switch Pete out for Blaze. Just because I do want to be able to, I want both Blaze and Pete to level up pretty well. Even though, if I remember right, most of the Pokemon in, uh... Or most of the trainers up in Sprout Tower just have Bellsprout, except for the big fame guy. So if we just get... Just feed him a bunch of... Seven experience points. Not a lot. Uh, if I just feed them to, uh... Uh, life is delightful. Always new discoveries to be made. Okay, so you do not heal us. Wonderful. Pile of strange coins, possibly from another country. Give us a Kakuna so Pete can fight. Another Pidgey. Want Pete to be able to fight these things. I actually just want Pete to be able to fight on its own, period. Without having to worry about having Blaze back it up right now. Come on. And episode, episode two is going to take longest anyway, just because I want it to. I want it to be. Uh, oh, what I want to say? Because uh, again, I'm trying to recreate recreate it. So episode. There's a Kakuna! There we go, level 4. Wild Kakunas only know... Harden. It's just perfect for Pete! Because Pete only knows Tackle. Harden versus Tackle, let's go. Come on, Pete. Let's go. There you go. Come on, Pete. My phone's on the other side of the room. I can't be like, hey. Do you even have a small screwdriver? Because again, uh, I don't know if I mentioned this before, but my glass, the no, I don't remember if I mentioned this, this episode already. It's been a long episode. Uh, the nose piece fell out of my glasses. Just before I started this episode. There we go, there's some experience for Pete. Level three. There we go. I like that. I suppose let's go get healed up and then we'll start to get on some trainers. Got the guy with the with the Rattata. Oh yeah, Pete's good. Pete's gold, so if we do need a I already picked I already picked the berry. Good. I just really need to get the 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 move points back, peep uh power points. Waiting for him to see again. What time is the gamer? What time does the game say it is? It is 521. Okay, I have about 40 minutes to get up to where I need to go, which is fine. Don't worry about it there. All right, another cocoon out. Hopefully, that's a weedle. Take it for now, and hopefully we don't get poisoned. Starts out with stop it, dropping my speed. Crap. Well, at least the poison's gonna do... <laughs> right now it looks like one damage over time, so if we just defeat this Weedle... 
as it keeps dropping our speed for some reason. I don't get it. There we go. And I'll use my only poison cure berry. So. So. Alright, let's go battle this first trainer. I just lost, so I'm trying to find my own po more Pokemon. Wait, you look weak. Come on, let's battle. Alright, so our first non-rival trainer is, is Youngster Joey, and he's got himself a Rattata. Alright, so we will go ahead and start out with Pete. Yikes. You know, let's go ahead and switch in my idea. Good, good test for my idea. Except when it tries to do that. Yeah, one damage compared to... Like, three. We'll say three. Just... Maybe two. I don't know. I don't know exactly how much health this Vitata has, but... Not a lot. That's for sure. Oh, now it's gonna do Tail Whip, which means it may possibly do two damage now every time I hit, or I get hit. Yep, two damage every time I get hit. Oh, that was three. Okay, there's still enough. Pete should, yep, Pete leveled up to level four, perfect. My idiot gets level 5! Nice! I don't have any more Pokemon! That's 64 bucks. Let's switch Ralph to the top. You're a Pokemon trainer, right? Then you have to battle! I mean, I don't have to. I will, but I don't have to. Alright, Youngster Mikey sends out a Pidgey. Level 2. Ow! Come on, Ralph! Live! <laughs> live, Ralph! Live! Go. Ralph hits level four. Very nice. Mikey's gonna send our Rattata. Let's just go ahead and bring in Blaze, because why not? Blaze needs some attention. I don't play not a defensive monster, but dang. Blaze well, gonna need to see we're gonna need to go see the Pokemon Center here in a minute. It's dang, dude! There we go, place is level seven. Defeat youngster Mikey! Strange, I went before. We also fought a level, f just one level four Rotata with a Pidgey and Rotata. I think you did fine. Uh, heal the health, sure. <coughs> Excuse me. Keep waiting. Like, I have no shame in going to the Pokemon Center. That's not a problem at all. Look, a Weedle. 
Ralph, please don't get poisoned. I did not buy any antidotes, so please don't get poisoned. Just hit this, hit this wheel and go. Ralph to poison. Unless I pump him full potion, or I got a berry. That should help. I'll have to. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, that's gonna be a problem, I think. But of course, I can only really buy so many antidotes. I buy two, that'll help. Alright, so let's go back. Try this excursion again, shall we? Let's see something real quick. Ah, oh, it's Pidgey. Sorry, just looking at it, if I need to grind in between episodes for just a little bit. If Ralph doesn't get some damage done here, I need to pull... Ooh, Ralph. Just barely, but it'd be enough. Not quite, but the next one I'll... The next one should be a trainer battle, so I should just be able to pull Ralph out pretty quick. Nope, the next one's a wild encounter. Please be. Nope, it's another Pidgey. I say, please be a. Uh, a Kakuna! No, I'm not a Kakuna. But we'll bring out. Maya the. Uh, I like to think that two damage that we took at the very beginning there's just kind of a brrr. The little extra point was like a, a stun damage kind of thing. Like, oh hey, I'm here. So I don't think it said it was a critical hit the first time around. And that goes. Yeah, Ralph should hit level 5. Nice. And learn his defense curl. That'll help. Let's go and switch Pete in, because I think he's... I know there's a bug catcher up here. Yeah, she's, she's not a trainer. But there's a... Nope. Yep. Yeah. There's a bug catcher here who we have to fight. And I think I think he starts with Caterpie. Yep. So a lot less of a threat is this Caterpie compared to uh, Weedle, primarily because Caterpie doesn't know poison sting. <laughs> that's it, that's the only reason. Now you're asking you're probably gonna ask yourself, why did you choose silver over gold? Well, when I bought it originally, it was cheaper. 
When I bought my original card, it was cheaper. My, uh, as a reminder, I'm playing on Welchie's card of Pokemon Silver. Because he had one, he's like, I'm not playing it. Go for it. A level of beat. Nice! And Pete learned Sand Attack! Not completely helpful, but it will work. Got another canopy? Uh, Blaze, go for it. I'll get Blaze some love, hopefully. Somebody in the slight distant future will learn something that's not Tackle. Can I think everybody right now that's battling with me knows Tackle? There we go. I'll catch you, John's defeated. Time is 5.33. Okay, so we got time. Yeah, we got a bit of time. Check the pocket if we check the map. We are on our route 31. So what is I'd probably actually give a potion to Pete just because he's the top of the party for right now. So what is our encounter on Route 31? It is a Weedle! Oh, that'll actually come in handy. So as long as Pete doesn't kill this thing, and it doesn't try to kill Pete with Poison Sting, let's throw a Pokeball at it! I dropped my controller! So one, a two, a three, done! Sweet! Weedle was caught! And Weedle was added to the Pokedex! I like this, actually. So you... Give me a second here. Oops, no. I keep doing the wrong thing. Set image. Find image. And it's right there. Submit. And shrink it down a little bit to fit it. Relatively within the Pokeball. It attacks using a two inch poison barb on its head. It can usually be found under the leaves it eats. Um. You know what? Slightly obscure reference in cross platforming. We're going to name you Faye. Uh, Faye is a. Uh, Digimon user in Cyber Sleuth, in Cyber, Cyber Sleuth Hacker's Memory, games that are on the channel. Uh, that use primarily, uh, she, her, uh, I guess her signature Pokemon is Tiger Vmon, which is a B. It's a wasp. Oh, sweet, a Kakuna! Level 5 Kakuna, too, for that matter. That's perfect for Pete. Something I'm glad I did not catch, and I will have to text Welch. You didn't, or you lucky buck, you didn't text me, or you didn't jinx me. He's now level six. Nice. Well, that was a good chunk of experience there. Uh, dark cave, Pokemon can light it up, and I'd explore it. That's because we would need Flash. Now let's go ahead and switch in Maya Via in for now. And I'm definitely going to go ahead and feed Faye a potion. We'll, we'll switch Faye in after we go in the dark cave. 
Got an antidote with that. That'll actually help. All right, so the Pokemon encounter on Route 6. If I ever get into one, is going to be a Zubat, okay. Level 2 Zubat, not a big deal. As long as my AV doesn't kill it. Life may actually have saved it. Nope. Nope, so we lost our encounter in the dark cave. That's okay. I'm sure I'll have more opportunities with it. with uh, Zubats later on. Yeah, I know it. We're gonna run. No sense in wasting time and effort on a Geodude. When we already have... Alright, so we're gonna switch Faye in just because... Try to get Faye leveled up at least. Yeah, this Pokeball, which contains a Pokeball. And then a Bitterberry. And walk too far? Be hurt and I'm sleepy. For a moral Pokemon, I'd be easy to catch. Just telling us that sleep is a thing. Some Weedle and the Weedle action. Okay, we'll go. Yeah, okay, that's not gonna go. That's gonna go nowhere quick. Uh, let's switch my idea. And it immediately get poisoned. Because of course. I think poison sting's gonna do or poison's gonna do more damage than poison sting. Fail, come on. One more tackle so we can save the health points. We can, we do. Great. Might be against level six. Nice. Nice defense curl. Cool. Oh, that's right. I was gonna give. Cause I do have one. Maybe it's gonna get an antidote. Another weedle. Lovely. to Violet City. We're almost to the end. I can't do far. I better phone home. All right, cool. We made it to Violet City. This is where we'll end the second episode. Because again, this is where I ended the second episode last time. So thank you all so much for watching. Next time, oh, excuse me. Uh, actually, I'm going to do a little bit of grinding until dark because next time we're going to start climbing the Sprout Tower. So, until tomorrow, when it gets when it's nice and dark outside in the game. I have been the Bowmeister, and I have been obediently yours.